Warning, before watching this video, I do not recommend you this video at all. So, if you want to watch this video, then just go ahead and do it. So, I'll be showcasing to you guys Hammond, and you cannot see it. I'm sorry if I cannot pronounce it correctly, because I ain't very good at pronouncing. Just gonna say that. But at least I uh, wrote it right. So, let's just go ahead and do this. So, here is some little info about Hammond. Um... Hammond is a stand. Yes, it is. <laughs> just, just kidding. It's not a stand. It's a spec. So, how to get this is, of course, you need to go to the shop, which I'm going right now. I should have just done that. You have to buy this at the shop. And the shop is right over there at this place right over here. Right over there. Can you not see it? If you can't, then you're, 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 you don't have a good eyesight. It's right over here. It is Steve, Steve's Bazaar shop right over there. And it will says here that welcome to my shop and you will buy the 4,000 Hammond if you're pretty much interested in it. Because a lot of people might possibly be interested. I'm not pretty sure if they truly are interested though. Like maybe they're interested, maybe not. But in Trello, it says here that the actual name is Jonathan Hammond. So or I don't I don't I can't pronounce his name okay I'm not like a freaking scholar boy that uh boy that knows how to spell but let's just go ahead and do this so that's how you can get Hammond and here are some passives abilities that you might want to know about it the uh, the first one is Hammond healing you will heal one percent of your health each second and then hammond sup superiority you will deal more damage to vampires than normal people okay that's pretty much it now going to the first ability which is going to be q ability this one is called hammond breathing and it will like show a yellowish aura and what this does you will start concentrating on your breathing this will buff your damage so your damage will be ugh, quite high when you punch and all that stuff possibly i don't know maybe it doesn't says here but it will buff your damage which means you can get more damage than it is now going to the next ability which is going to be the e ability which is sunlight yellow overdrive just go ahead and hold it or just click it and th this will do is you will start barraging at god speed using your ham and energy dealing 3.75 damage per hit so that's that with the sunlight yellow overdrive now going to the next ability it is going to be scarlet overdrive it is an r ability what this does is infuse your hand with hammond energy to do a heavy punch ragdolling the enemy dealing 32.5 damage so that's the scarlet overdrive now going to the next ability i'm just going to show it to you guys once again it's red red auras and red effects now going to the next ability which is going to be oh yeah that was wrong that we're going to do is the zoom punch which is a t ability so what this does is of course it's a range ability i'm gonna say to you to myself because then you zoom your arm because you, you, you like to look here t ability let's do this t ability one more time i need to wait though uh, there it's a kind of a range ability a little bit range so what this does you break your shoulder to create an illusion causing the enemy to think your arm was extended ragdolling the opposing player for 25 damage so you can ragdoll them and of course it says that you break your arm uh, no your shoulder now going to the next ability is going to be y ability and this ability is called ground overdrive now just go ahead and click y and then what this does is you will infuse your ham and energy to punch the ground making anyone close to you take damage and be ragdolled for 15 damage so if you did that it will be like create this uh, yellowish circle and whoever is around that yellowish circle will get damage and some it seems like somebody has a ham and and is kind of ready to fight me please do not get over here perfect thank you <laughs> thank you now going to the next ability which is going to be the last ability of this um spec it is going to be pluck sword you what this does is of course click f and it will get a sword you will infuse your hammond energy into the sword you will swing it at the enemy doing 30 damage you will like 
and they create your own sword out of nowhere. Maybe it's like the wind or something, you create a sword, and of course, it does sword slicing with 30 damage. Yeah, that's pretty much that's pretty much it. Now going to the other thing, here are uh, once again the stat graph. I think the stat graph is possibly broken. <laughs> There's nothing here. But there are some extra extra abilities that you can use or like stuff you can use for Hammond. Like, such as the posing, such as the rolling, and of course the leaping. Because you leap. See? Now as you can see, that is that for this video. I have nothing more to show you guys. Nothing more really to do that I can show you with the Hammond showcasing thingy. But that is particularly it for this video. So yeah, I hope you have a nice day. And of course, bye.